Right. It's like it says, um, yeah, back at uh, verse 22. For many of them that dwell upon the earth shall perish of famine and the others shall escape the hunger, shall the sword destroy. All right. But the point in the mid, the point it is, is of uh, Salaki, verse 20. But for all these things, they shall not turn from their wickedness, nor be always mindful of their scourges. So it's like the Lord is exalting a lot of energy of judgment, but he's not getting your attention. He's causing things to blow up, earthquakes, wildfires across 14 states, you know, mass shootings, okay, lightnings to be struck down. And people have seen this and they're like, wow, that's crazy. But yo, how, yo, you going to that game? Like, yo, we going to still hit the club? Yo, it's like you're not even mindful. The most High is going through all of this, these wonderful judgments, amazing Shocking judgments. And we're not mindful. How stupid can we be? How simple could we be? All right? To not turn and say, yo, you know what? I'm going to chill the fuck out right now. I want to tap into this guy. I want to get to know him that's going. I want to understand what he, want, what he wants me to know. You know? That's it. So once again, you are the Hebrew Israelites. And everything that's being shot at you will be personal. All right? And here's what the, 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 the scriptures call Jacob's trouble. And once again, it is being done just so we could turn back and tell our Lord. See, the Lord is extreme. All right? He's a jealous God. He'll go far for his woman just for her to turn back. But he wants you to turn back. All right? But he's going to create a whole scenario for stuff to be effed up. And those who don't, they will judge. They will be judged and they will die. All right? But this is uh, Jeremiah 30 and 7, which reads, uh, Alas, for that day is great, so that there is none like it. It is even the time of Jacob's trouble, but he shall be saved out of it. That's it. Excuse me. For it shall come to pass in that day, saith the Lord of hosts, that I will break his yoke from off thy neck. All right? And will burst our bonds, and strangers shall no more serve themselves of him. So we're going to be free. All right, we're going to be no more a part of this system and say you're in a, oh, hey, yes, I'm an American. I'm this. I need a passport to travel. I need an ID. I need a jab. No, all of those contracts and I need a driver's license. All of that is bull BS. You never needed that to travel across the world. Like the earth is going to ask you for your pass. Like there's a there's a, there's a a tree god somewhere. And, and, and if you don't show this tree god your pass, the fucking land will just soup you up and devour you. And, and, and then spit you out into the deepest parts of the core of the earth where you burn and die. No. You know, if you don't show him this pass. Meanwhile, the pass is made out of a tree, out of his paperwork. I mean, the tree should slap the shit out of you. You know, this is this is BS. This is BS. But this is all the stuff that this devil sits and laugh about. <laughs> you know, meanwhile, he don't got to show no paperwork. He flies around in his jets. You think they need to show who they are? Hell no. All right. So all of this birth, but this is how you this is how you know you're in captivity. But they shall serve the Lord their God and David their king. See, David, David in the flesh died a long time ago. So how are we gonna do that? It's because this is gonna be set up the right way. So all you people who thought we were just stupid, crazy, looking like bums out there talking some craziness, you're gonna really see, you're gonna really know who we are when the Lord Raise us up in this last time. You're going to really see. You're going to hear this talk. This is going to be the talk all the time, 24-7. Same way we had to listen to you, you corny-ass Charlemagne, you corny-ass rappers, and you corny-ass uh, female artists, and you corny-ass talker boys, and corny-ass fucking um, um, corny-ass niggas on Instagram making corny-ass jokes. Bro, this is going to be the talk all 24-7. Fact. That's a big fact, Right? They're going to serve, this up, serve the Lord their God and David their king, whom I will raise up unto them. And David took no tolerance all right, about those who ain't served the Lord. So y'all going to be on board. Therefore, fear thou not, O my servant Jacob, saith the Lord, neither be dismayed, O Israel. For lo, I will save thee from afar. But that comes with faith, and that comes with repenting, and that comes for looking for the help for who? From God. And then say that he's going to use a so-called white man. You, you take his jab and save yourself and do all that. No. He's going to break us away from the system because it's going to be a big apartheid when you're not taking his jab, when you're not taking the MRK. 
All right. But we're going to that's what's going to make you lean upon the Lord and see what the Lord will provide. Why not? The Lord provide the sun. The so-called white man didn't make the sun. He didn't make it rain. He didn't make a tree. He didn't make fruit. He didn't make lambs. So why you got to trust upon him to eat? Come on. That's some that's some retarded shit. He I mean, he's didn't play with our minds so far that we think we got to get everything through him. We didn't even create this world. If he did, he would have gave himself some fucking melanin and he wouldn't be poisoned from the sun. He would have also gave himself a stronger size, a bigger size than us. So he don't be walking around looking weak as shit and then, you know, having to um, always get his ass kicked by Jake in every sport. Anyway, it says, I will save thee from afar and I see from the land of their captivity. So the most high is going to do that. Ain't nobody going to free you. Oh, yes. You know, we need to vote for this president, that, that president, so they can free us from our conditions. They put you in those conditions. Why would they free you from out of it? You, you sound slow. It says, and Jacob shall return and shall re be in rest. We're going to return unto who? Unto the Lord and in our land. He's going to put us in, all right, which is Israel. And we're going to be in rest, meaning we're going to be in peace. We're going to have a peace of mind amongst each other. We're going to have a peace of mind amongst yourself. You ain't going to be in a deep depression because you don't have this, that. Oh, man, look at my life. Huh, I ain't shit. Huh. No, you're going to be at rest because you're going to be good. You're going to be at rest amongst your people because you're not going to be eyeing each other, fucking battling and going at it 24-7. Or you're going to be at rest because you're going to be pulled over by no other nations or heathen officers, you know, harassing you. All right? And be quiet and none shall make him afraid. <laughs> you know? None shall make him afraid. Like the, like the priest Taiwan was saying. Like you 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 fucking scared of, of a fucking pin drop because you got a, a, a active warrants out on your ass. So every little thing you jumping around, nervous and scared. <laughs> oh, man. All right. With that being said, man, I'm going to end this off, man. Repent. Turn back. Israel, turn back. All right. Let's get, give this a shot. The name of the Lord is Yahweh, the Most High. His son's name is Yahweh Shah. Repent. Turn back to the names. Ask that he put a spirit on you to guide you. You know, come to acknowledgement that this is what we need. For real. Put that forth, all right? And call all you how by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, Rukh for pouring out His Spirit upon us in these last days. With that being said, Shalom, and peace and love to those who are listening and taking this truth in sincerity. Shalom.